Mr. Glover. Oh, Mr. Glover, come on. Come on over. How you doing, brother? I'm here. Okay, is a, is this like a just another Sunday for you or what? I feel like you've been you've been here, you've done this. I've been here, but this is so special. I mean, I'm I'm telling you, and I'm, and I'm not I'm not bullying you, you know. But this is fancy. I have this this wonderful wonderful filmmaker with me, Yancey Ford. And he's done a remarkable job in creating something that's really spe special for all of us to see, you know. We've been, we've been involved, he's, it's an eight-year journey for Yancey. We've been involved in the last four years, and it's been extraordinary with, my, with the film company, our company, Louverture Films. And I have to say, I'm getting into work, I'm even getting to say, Louverture Films! Do you see how fired up Danny Glover is? Louverture Films! And Yancey, and, and Jocelyn Strong Island would not be possible, would not have been possible without Louverture, without Jocelyn as the producer, without Danny as the EP. As a first time filmmaker, to have the journey of the last 10 to 12, 15 years of my life conclude at the Oscars Hello. with all of the firsts that this nomination represents to be here with the folks who have stood by me throughout this entire process is an incredible honor. Yeah. And it just happens to be, you know, it happens to be Danny I mean, Glover you know. and happens <laughs> to be Jocelyn Barnes, two of the most prolific producers in the documentary field. And how did you two meet? Oh, on the set, uh, almost 20 years ago. Yes, in, uh, in Senegal, in, in Dakar, Senegal. Senegal, Senegal. Danny Senegal. was in a film that I wrote. Yes. And, and we haven't stopped talking since. <laughs> and that's the best thing that's happened. We haven't stopped talking since. And imagining and trying to figure out what are the kind of, what are the kind of projects we want to bring to audience. How do we become citizens, not simply artists, but citizens as well? And that's what Louverture is talking about. Citizenship, history, telling stories that normally don't get, are not told in, 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 the, in the public space. That's what we're seeing creating tonight. creating another paradigm, yeah. creating another voice. I have not seen you this excited and a lot, like you are like ready to go. Look here, what else? <laughs> look here. Look here. We're here on look the verge of, we're on the cusp of history <laughs> yeah. tonight. We've made, we've made history. Yeah. What, tell me, have you seen Black Panther? Yeah. What did you think? I, I thought it was an extraordinary movie. It was really, uh, extraordinary. I mean, I, I, I mean, just the whole, the whole layout of it and everything. Would you it, ever have imagined being a kid, seeing a film of this scale, of this magnitude, received the way that it was with this basically all black cast, helmed by black people? Well, you know, I, I, you know, I, I, I'm, I come in the age of Sidney Poitier, you know, exactly. <laughs> and just to see Sidney Poitier step in front of the camera was magic to me. I mean, I was awestruck, but this is something very special. I, th I think it is, it's, wow, it's one layer of the dynamic that we have to deal with. What are the images that we want to create? How do we want, how do we want our kids to be nurtured by what they see in film? So this is a part of it, you know, but we got so much more work to do in terms of how do we realize the ideas and all the, 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 the building the kind of community that we, we're all so desperate for in that sense. And I think that's what we have. This is one step in that direction. If a young kid goes in there and says, I think something, I could do something important in my community, important in my world, then that's something that, that, that's important. It's happening. It's happening. Right. There it is. Thanks baby. for lighting up the uh, I mean, right. I'm pumped.